Hello guys, in this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create questionnaire form for OTK Collect using Cobra Toolbox. Let's begin. Uh, here, I'll be using one sample questionnaire. Here, this is the sample survey questionnaire that I will use uh, during this uh, tutorial video for making questionnaire form. Go over your browser and then open cobotoolbox.org. Now go to get started and go over sign up or login. Yeah, I have already created uh, my account. You also need to create your own account for using this uh, Kobo toolbox. Go over create an account and you write your information over here and uh, create your account in Cobra Toolbox. I already have my account in Cobra Toolbox and I'll be going through this. Once you create your toolbox, then you will get this uh, type of platform. In order to create questionnaire form using Cobra Toolbox, go over new and select project and write the name of the project under this section. Here I'm writing sample survey and under this description section you can write the, the description related to your project and you can select the sector to which uh, the project is related under this section here I am selecting health services and public health and uh, you can select the country uh, where the survey is going to take place here I am selecting and now create project now this type of layout will appear after you create your project. Now let's go uh, to our question. First three questions, date of data collection, time of data collection, ID of device. Here all three are automatic variables. They are not necessary to be entered manually. They will be captured by OTK Collect from system of uh, Android phone or tablet or other devices that is used to collect data. For these variables, go over metadata and then select start time in time today device id and depending on your need you can select username sim serial subscriber id and phone number and now next question is participant id in order to add next question in scoba toolbox select plus sign and then add the question participant id and then click add question here participant ID is a integer variable so select number and in order to set the features of this variable go over setting and then here you need to be careful while setting up uh, these things under logic uh, section and under validation criteria here data column name here this is the name that will be displayed as a variable name in excel or spss or other tools so write this very carefully here i am writing participant id and you can add a question hint under this section and you can check yes if this response is required if you select yes then you cannot uh, go to next question without entering this question and uh, you can add default response like for weight you can add default response and for other features you can add default response our survey consists of participant id from 1000 to 9999 so go over validation criteria and add a condition here it is from 1000 to 9999 so greater than or equal to 1000 and less than or equal to and whenever if you enter the value beyond this range then uh, error message will appear I will write enter participant ID uh, from 1000 to 9999 okay. and next question is collect GPS of the place 
for this go over plus sign and then write question collect list and click add question here this is point variable so select that and you go over settings and then enter the name of the variable here I am writing it as GPS okay. and you can add hint or other right now I am not adding anything now next question is do you want to participate in our survey here add plus sign here this is single choice question so go over select one and then define the options here option one is yes and option two is no and value for yes here is yes and value for no is no now go over settings and add the name of the variable here uh, here I am writing the name of the variable as uh, consent yes and right now I am not adding anything else uh, I'll be dealing with uh, skip logic later in this video tutorial now next question is name of the participant name of the participant here it is text variable so go over plus sign add participant okay and here this is text variable now go over settings and write the name of the variable here I am writing participant name now next question is collect participant photo go over plus sign photo add question and this is photo variable image variable so then go over setting here I am keeping the variable name as participant photo and next question is data birth of participant for that go over plus sign data birth of participant add question and this is a date variable it is to be entered manually so click date option and then go over setting here name the data column as data birth and now next question is address under the address first question is district go over plus sign add district district and add question here district it is a, a single choice question so select one here the options are option one option two option three option four okay and automatic variables name will be option one option 4 okay these are option 1 option 2 option 3 option 4 this this will be displayed in question and these values will be the if you click option 1 this value will be displayed okay and in order to add more options click this field here now next question is municipality name or BDC name go over plus sign here it is text variable add question here it is text variable add text and go over setting here is okay and now next uh, question is word it is integer variable this is integer variable and another is landmark it is text variable it is text variable and another is how many members are there in your family here it is integer variable here it is integer variable select one and 
go over setting here I am setting the name of the variable as family members okay and the next question here is under question number 12 detail of pure presence or absence in every members so here add question name it is text variable another is 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 numerical variable and another is gender gender it is single choice question option one male option two female value two option one is option one is male and value two option two is female now next question is does he or uh, she have fever in past six days yes or no go over does he or she have fever in past six months this is the question add question and then it is a select one option either yes or no uh, option one is yes and uh, option two is no value to option one is yes and option two is no over setting for multiple response question What do you think caused by add question here it is select many it is multiple response question so select many here option one is here option one is smoking alcohol next is pollution next is ba bad deeds next is bad deeds and next is mutation next is pesticides and here these options give automatic Now, the next question is obviously the assessment height weight here for height height here it is decimal and next is weight weight here it is weight is decimal In next video, I will show you how to create groups, add repeat questions, add skips in questions.